In 2017, the government rolled out a new program that sought to grow the contribution of manufacturing to GDP from 9% to 15% by the year 2022. This was to involve stakeholders' participation from the public as well as the private sector. Well, we are now in 2022. Have we managed to achieve this aspiration? This week on Inside Government, we want to look at industrialization, the heat and the basis. We're joined by Principal Secretary in the Ministry of Industrialization and Trade. This is Ambassador Kaberia Keremi. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you. This week's episode of Inside Government. Uh, when you look at the last five years, um, what conclusions do you make in terms of uh, making policies and uh, steps towards making Kenya an industrialized nation. Thank you very much, uh, O'Brien, for having me again. It's always a pleasure to have this opportunity to be in your show. But even more importantly, to reach out to the many Kenyans and to try and explain this journey and where we have reached. I'm happy to uh, say that uh, in the last five years, we have seen a tremendous expansion in the footprint of industry in the country. Mm -hmm. Albeit at different levels, but even comparing ourselves uh, to other players globally, Kenya has actually made a very good stride in the last five years. If you uh, look at um, uh, areas of iron and steel, Kenya has really grown. We have moved from the traditional blacksmith to Juakali, from Juakali. Now we have a lot of different small to medium-sized enterprises that produce the regular consumables, the nails, the fencing, the 